Welcome to the future of the internet. We interact with the digital world every single day, from social media to streaming services, but we rarely stop to think about the infrastructure that powers it all. That infrastructure is almost entirely owned and controlled by a handful of massive tech corporations. This centralization creates vulnerabilities, single points of failure, censorship risks, and serious data privacy concerns. What if there was another way? What if the internet itself could be a single, global, decentralized computer? The graphic morphs from centralized nodes into a widely distributed, interconnected network. That is the vision behind the Internet Computer Protocol, or ICP. It's not just another cryptocurrency or a new app. It is a foundational shift in how we build and run digital services. The ICP is engineered to bypass traditional data centers entirely, creating a world where applications are unstoppable, secure by default, and owned by their users, not corporations. In this deep dive, we're going to explore the architectural revolution that makes this possible. From the lightning-fast chain key cryptography to the unique canister smart contracts that can host entire websites. We'll unpack how the system uses internet identity to replace clunky passwords and discuss the powerful governance model that puts control back in the hands of the community. The nonprofit Dfinity Foundation is spearheading this ambitious mission to return the internet to its open, innovative roots. So, if you're ready to understand the technology that could redefine the digital landscape, stay tuned. Let's dive in and explore the worldwide computer. This video is created for educational and informational purposes only. It does not promote or endorse any financial product, investment, or cryptocurrency. All information presented here is based on publicly available sources and independent analysis. Viewers are encouraged to conduct their own research before making any financial or technological decisions. The Internet Computer Protocol, ICP, represents one of the most ambitious undertakings in the blockchain and distributed systems arena. Its core mission, spearheaded by the nonprofit Dfinity Foundation, is to fundamentally reimagine and rebuild the global computing platform from a centralized, corporate controlled infrastructure into a decentralized, open, and scalable network. The Foundation argues that the original Internet was designed primarily for communication, not as a reliable, secure computational engine. The modern Internet relies heavily on a handful of tech giants Amazon Web Services, AWS, Google Cloud, and Microsoft Azure to host vast swathes of human data and critical applications. This centralization introduces significant vulnerabilities, single points of failure, censorship risks, data privacy concerns, and the effective monopolization of digital power. The ICP was engineered specifically to solve these fundamental flaws. It proposes a public, trustless computational layer that can host everything from simple websites to complex, enterprise-level social networks directly on a decentralized ledger, bypassing traditional IT infrastructure entirely. The goal is to return the Internet to its open, innovative roots, where applications are owned by communities rather than corporations, and user data remains secure and private by default. Architectural Revolution, Chain Key Cryptography, and the Worldwide Computer the technical innovation that allows the Internet computer to function at web speed and scale globally is a unique protocol called chain key cryptography. Traditional blockchains like Bitcoin and Ethereum are relatively slow when compared to centralized IT systems because every node in the network must verify every transaction. This bottleneck limits transactional throughput and scalability. Chain key cryptography fundamentally alters this paradigm. It enables a single public key to verify all updates on the Internet computer, regardless of how many nodes are added or removed from the network over time. This breakthrough drastically reduces the cryptographic overhead. It allows smart contracts, which ICP calls canisters, to process query calls in milliseconds, making the platform feel indistinguishable from traditional cloud services in terms of user experience. This high performance transforms the blockchain from merely a ledger of value into a viable, general-purpose platform capable of running a worldwide computer. It allows developers to build sophisticated applications without worrying about the latency or cost issues typical of earlier blockchain iterations. The ICP functions as an efficient consensus mechanism that can seamlessly weave together an infinite number of subnets, smaller, independent blockchains that work in concert, into a single, cohesive network. Canister Smart Contracts – The Evolution of WebAssembly The computational units that run on the Internet computer are called Canister Smart Contracts. 
These are a significant evolution from the basic smart contracts found on Ethereum. Canisters are effectively powerful, highly secure software containers that can store gigabytes of data, unlike typical smart contracts limited to small data storage, and perform complex computations using standard programming languages like Rust and Motoko, a language specifically designed for the ICP. The key difference is that a canister smart contract does not just manage token transfers, it can contain an entire application, including the front-end user interface, the back-end logic, and the persistent data storage. When a user interacts with a website or service hosted on the ICP, they are downloading the interface directly from the blockchain via their web browser. This direct interaction removes numerous intermediaries, such as cloud providers and HTTP servers, drastically reducing attack vectors for hackers and ensuring that the application remains permissionless and censorship resistant. Because canisters can communicate with each other seamlessly, the network allows for highly composable applications where complex digital services can be built like interlocking Lego blocks. Tokenomics, Governance, NNS, and the Cycles Mechanism The economic structure of the ICP is designed to sustain a global, self-governing utility. The native token, also named ICP, serves three primary purposes – governance, fuel, and rewards. Token holders can participate in network governance by locking their tokens into neurons within the Network Nervous System, NNS, an open, algorithmic governance system. The NNS functions as a decentralized autonomous organization, DAO, that manages all aspects of the network, from upgrading the protocol to onboarding new data centers. Users stake their ICP to vote on proposals and are rewarded with newly minted ICP tokens for their participation. To prevent short-term speculation, neurons must be locked for a minimum duration, up to eight years. The second economic mechanism is cycles. Cycles are a stable computational fuel used to power canister smart contracts, analogous to gas on Ethereum. However, the mechanism is inverted. In ICP, the developers prepay for the computing power using cycles, which are pegged to the SDR currency basket for price stability allowing end-users to interact with dApps without needing to manage cryptocurrency wallets or pay transaction fees. This reverse gas model removes a major barrier to mainstream adoption of Web3 applications. Data centers are paid for providing computational power with ICP tokens, completing the economic loop that secures and maintains the global computer. Internet Identity – A Seamless and Secure Authentication System One of the most practical and user-friendly innovations brought by the ICP is Internet Identity, not for UI. The traditional internet relies heavily on usernames and passwords, which are notoriously insecure and cumbersome to manage. We often rely on centralized OAuth providers like Login with Google or Login with Facebook, which further consolidate data control within those corporations. The Internet Identity System replaces this broken model with a private and secure authentication framework. Instead of a password, users register a unique anchor number using a hardware security device, such as a YubiKey or built-in biometric scanners, Face ID, Touch ID, on their devices. When logging into a dApp on the ICP, the user's device communicates securely with the identity anchor without ever exposing personal information or private keys to the application itself. This provides strong anonymity and eliminates the risk of websites storing passwords that could be breached. A user can register multiple devices to a single identity anchor, allowing them to recover access if a device is lost. This is a game-changer for Web3 security, offering enterprise-grade security with the convenience of Web2 usability. The Future Vision Building an Open, Transparent Internet The ultimate promise of the Internet Computer protocol is not just faster transaction speeds or new ways to log in, but the creation of a fundamentally new paradigm for digital existence. By operating entirely on a decentralized ledger managed by a global community via the NNS, the ICP inherently resists censorship and corporate capture. It provides a platform where intellectual property can be tokenized, software updates are transparent and verifiable, and user governance is the standard rather than the exception. For developers, this means their creations can live forever on a permissionless network without fear of being delisted by an app store or banned by a cloud provider. For users, it means ownership and sovereignty over their data and digital identities. While the journey to replace the existing internet infrastructure is monumental, the ICP provides the technical blueprints for a genuine public utility. 
a worldwide computer that serves humanity as a neutral and open platform. The ongoing development by the DFINITY team and the expanding ecosystem of dApps being built upon it suggests that the vision of a decentralized cloud is moving rapidly from theoretical possibility to practical reality. The scalability of the Internet Computer Protocol, ICP, is not achieved through a single massive blockchain that processes all information sequentially. Instead, the architecture relies on a highly sophisticated topology composed of interconnected subnets. A subnet is essentially a small, independent blockchain in its own right, operated by a specific set of powerful node machines run by certified independent data centers around the globe. This design is crucial for parallel processing. The network can run countless subnets simultaneously, each dedicated to hosting different applications or functions. The ICP protocol ensures seamless, fast communication between these subnets, making the underlying fragmentation invisible to the end user. The Network Nervous System, NNS, a DAO that runs the Internet. The governance model of the Internet Computer, the Network Nervous System, NNS, is arguably the most complex and powerful decentralized autonomous organization, DAO, in existence. The NNS is not just a voting mechanism. It is the autonomous brain that manages the entire network as a utility. It is an open, permissionless system that orchestrates everything from software upgrades of the core protocol to economic parameters. Anyone who holds ICP tokens can stake them into neurons within the NNS. Staking involves locking up the tokens for a defined period, ranging from six months to eight years. The longer the lockup period, the greater the voting power and the higher the potential rewards for the neuron holder. This system aligns the incentives of the participants with the long-term health and success of the network. Neuron holders vote on proposals, which can range from simple text suggestions to complex software binary upgrades that are automatically and autonomously deployed across all nodes if passed. This automated, algorithmic governance ensures that the network is always evolving, improving security, scalability, and efficiency without relying on a central authority to push updates manually. It is designed to be censorship-resistant and community-driven, embodying the true spirit of decentralization. Contrasting ICP with Web2 Cloud and traditional blockchain, Web3. To fully appreciate the Internet Computer Protocol, it helps to contrast it with the existing landscapes it seeks to disrupt. Web2 Cloud Providers, AWS, Google Cloud. Web2 services offer excellent speed, scalability, and user experience, but they are centralized. A single company decides who can use their servers and can shut down an application at any moment, as seen with social media platforms being deplatformed. Data is stored in proprietary databases owned by the corporation and is often vulnerable to data breaches and misuse. The ICP maintains the high performance of Web2 but decentralizes the infrastructure, eliminating single points of failure in corporate control. Applications run on ICP are permissionless and unstoppable. Traditional Blockchain – Ethereum, Solana Traditional Web3 platforms are decentralized but often struggle with limitations. Ethereum is robust but expensive and slow for mainstream applications that require frequent state changes like real-time social media interactions or complex gaming. Solana offers high throughput, but has faced centralization concerns and network outages. The ICP differs by using chain-key cryptography and subnet architecture to achieve internet-level speed and unbounded scalability. It doesn't rely on simple token transactions. It runs general computation, allowing full-stack dApps to be hosted entirely on-chain, which is impractical on most other blockchains today. The Expanding Ecosystem and Developer Environment The success of any protocol depends on the ecosystem of applications being built on top of it. The ICP ecosystem is growing rapidly, fostering diverse projects across various sectors. Developers are attracted by the ease of development, using standard languages like Rust and Motoko, and the unique reverse gas model, which makes their applications immediately accessible to mainstream users without requiring crypto wallet setup or gas fees for every action. Examples within the ecosystem include decentralized social media platforms like DSCVR and District, which offer a Web3 alternative to Reddit or Medium, allowing users to own their content and governance of the platforms. There are also robust DeFi projects, enterprise solutions utilizing the secure canister technology, and Web3 gaming platforms that leverage the speed and data storage capabilities of the ICP. 
The developer environment is supported by comprehensive documentation and SDKs from the DFINITY Foundation, providing a smooth transition path for traditional Web2 developers looking to build in a decentralized environment. This vibrant ecosystem is crucial evidence of the protocol's viability and future potential. All right, if you learned something new or enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell icon so you don't miss future updates. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.